Let's lay out some rooms in 3D. The only way we can do this is we need to take a orthographic or perspective floor overview and go ahead and get to your interior wall tool. Hover your cover cursor over the top of an existing wall here and then draw out your new wall. Now to set the distance between these two walls, there's two methods. One is I can drag it towards that existing wall until it bumps. So you need to make sure that you have bumps turned on. And then I'm gonna hit my enter or tab key. And so long as polar is left checked, I can make a subtraction of the offset that I'd like. So if I want 12 feet in between these two rooms, I'm gonna say minus 12 foot from the dimension that's already there. Now that that's set, let's go back to the working plan view and we can confirm that this actually worked. There we go. It has in fact moved 12 feet offset from that existing wall. Let's do it one more time. Second method would be that I bump this all the way to that exterior wall, let go of that cursor, let that wall leave in place, and then start dragging it away from that wall. And same thing, tab or enter and set that 12 foot offset and go check it in plan. And in fact, we did move it 12 feet.